so sorry for royalty. Hey, be this bitch in here. Hey, it's Marie, thanks for clicking me, where I give you thoughts and opinions and spill the real tea. Welcome back, subbies, to my channel. I already know why you're here. You ready for me to spill the tea? But, if you're new and you haven't seen me before, that's cool, that's cool. Go ahead and hit subscribe so you can be in tune. Also, welcome to my channel. Here, I'm It's Marie, and we do thoughts and opinions and spill the real tea. Cool. Now that we got all that shit out the way, Martin Lewis dropped some... Martin Lewis dropped the real tea. And I'm just going to give you my thoughts and opinions on it. So, let's get in straight. Let's get straight to the tea. Recently, CJ So Cool made a video apologizing. Not only that, guys, Lee is coming for the drama channels and is talking to YouTube allegedly. But before allegedly. we get into that, there is so much other stories I need to cover. So let's get straight into, into the, the drama. drama. Do not go to any of these channels sending them any hate or anything like that. I'm not here for that. This is not a hate channel. Now let's move on to the CJ So Cool apology. Okay. And guys, it wasn't him apologizing for cheating and lying to you guys, which would have been nice. It was basically a stupid apology and how he's not perfect. But hey, let's go watch it. He basically starts what? the video talking to royalty. And I have to go to the baby store and buy twin bed sets? I don't know. This isn't like my profession. I don't know what to do. This was supposed to be something that you did with me because you wanted to have the kid, you know what I mean? Now I got to have myself out there sick and weak. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait a goddamn minute. Did he just come out of his mouth and say, I shouldn't have to do this. It's supposed to be your job. I didn't want these kids. You did. But this is what y'all looking up to. This is who y'all aspire to be. Cool. Now I'm made. Now I know what to do. And I need to go get some peppers. I don't know what size peppers they were. So he basically tries to make out that royalty wanted the kids and he didn't want them. Mm. And he apologized for acting this way. All right, I must admit, that is a little weird hearing myself say it, that she wanted the kids and not me. But a portion of that is sick. Pause. You can't give no apology with a butt. That's not an apology. That's not an apology, baby. I'm sorry for slapping you on the face, but you needed it. What you apologizing for? See this? Semi truth because I'm just trying to say that it wasn't my idea to go get these kids. But I agreed. Alright, I signed the paper, I paid the fee. I agreed as a team to go forward with this process. So I can no longer say she wanted these kids. So did you agree because she wanted to, just so you can do it, or was it just like, yeah, I want kids? So this gives me the impression that he really doesn't want these kids. <laughs> Bro, Martin Lewis be on it. Because you signed an agreement does not mean that you want kids. So what it is, is royalty wanted more kids. CJ did not. In order to keep his family and make his wife happy, he signed the paper to do the process. Okay, you got to raise these kids. You got to be there for these kids. Y'all. Let me put you up on game real quick. When you see somebody for who they are, pay attention. Pay attention. Because when Cedar Kaku was doing all that reckless with her kids, that should have told you right there, why would you want to reproduce with him?
Like, honestly, he put her kids through a lot. Hell, he put his own child through a lot in some of the videos that I've seen on the shade room and all that other stuff. Like, are you shocked that you didn't want these kids? The twins that she's about to almost stress herself to death about? Put her life on the line for? But you didn't want them? Help me understand this. I'll wait. Tips for my young women out there, for my ladies out there. Do not settle. Do not lower your expectations for a man. Know your worth. Know what you bring to the table. And know why you're in a relationship. Because this right here, nigga, will get a motherfucking scene. Like, you just publicly embarrassed me twice. Not including the other times that he's cheated. And you riding for this nigga. Ain't no much money in the world, bro. Period. <laughs> when he gets the kids he's not gonna be like that but then again he we was hope. like that with his first child you know what i mean it was like kept a secret just saying not hating i've been a jerk all right i'm kind of mean in real life it's hard right? after five years of being up here and having people look up to you and being a role model i mean without me having a role model how long can i actually do this basically what i'm trying to say is some of you don't get it, you won't get it, and I don't expect you to get it because you're not me. But being CJ So Cool and Cordero is hard. I have a split personality. Um, I'm more than one person. When I cut this camera off, I'm CJ So Cool. When I cut the camera off, I'm Cordero. Now, Cordero is a good guy. CJ So Cool is a great guy. Actually, CJ So Cool is a splendid, wonderful, perfect guy. It's like a real manipulative sociopath. Correct. Anyway, Jack, the ah. thing CJ has been telling you is that he has not been in a relationship with Nike when he has. He was engaged with Nike. He what? Too, but then later on changed it. He got Nike's name tattooed on his back. But play on your emotion to get more likes on live. Y'all bring in my boo before 2 p.m., right? She goes, yeah, she goes, thank you, you're welcome. And then he goes, by the way, when I saw you, my heart dropped. I'm still in love with you. Not only that, he's happy to feel other girls' booties on Snapchat. A few years back, he did a prank, giving his stepkids a laxative. I'm using them anyway. I, I don't care. I'm going to crush about 4 of these up and mix them in some ice cream. And Martin Lewis is the GOAT. Like, no cap. 
Martin Lewis will take some and tear it down point by point, angle by angle, unlike other T pages, thoughts and opinions that don't got facts. I'm just saying. This is crazy. But yet he's doing what get him views. He's doing what y'all will watch. Abusing, neglecting, and mistreating these goddamn kids. But yet you wanted to have more. Y'all, I really need y'all to explain this to me. Is it me? Am I tripping? Because Martin Lewis is on a roll. See, that cool needs to be canceled too. Oh, um, like, for real, like, because if y'all really want to put this into perspective, think of the, what, see, there's a cool, he's, he's at, what, over a mil? Think of, let's say he got five mil subscribers on YouTube. Half of those five mil are probably young men, young boys, that think this behavior is okay. When you know you have a big platform, some shit you just don't do. Just like it's a rule, it's unspoken rules for different races, different kinds of people. For like girl code, guy code, certain stuff, even though it's not in the book, you just know not to do. But yet we're encouraging, acknowledging, watching, posting, Laughing at this bullshit like it's okay. <sighs> Y'all always about to raise my blood pressure. Because I just feel so sorry for royalty. Because we done seen how he is on camera. And for something to be so normal on camera, imagine what's going on behind closed doors. Like for real. Because when something is easy to do on camera, bruh, that's nothing compared to what they do when nobody watches. Because I understand that. And it's for me to change, for me to fix, and it's not for any of you to judge. Because you know what? Only God can judge me at the end anyway. Oh my God! Oh my God, here we go. When someone can't take valid criticism for the mistakes and the foul stuff that they present online and do... Preach! You can't judge, only God can. And you know what? So can a fucking judge. A judge can also judge. And you can judge. Oh yep. God. You have that right. I'm pretty sure this is what Jesus is gonna do when you go to heaven. Yeah, I'm finally here. Let me in. I'm amazing. What in the Satan is wrong with your teeth? Oh! Mm -mm. I'm sorry, but we didn't make it like that. Maybe if I sing this beautiful song, we can heal your satanic teeth. So, I'm just here to let you guys know that I'm sorry. I, got, I already told my girl royalty I'm sorry because it's just cruel. The way that I was talking and the way I was acting and the way I was allowing my character to take over my personality. You're a moron. Can't judge me. I can judge me, but you can't judge me. That's right. You can't judge other people. Before you do, point the finger at yourself and find out if you yourself are perfect. You're so, if you take that in consideration, why haven't you... Check yourself out. You just sat here and said you let your character speak. Y'all, yet again, when a mother can show you who they are, pay attention. If this is your character, meaning your morals, what you believe, your values, who you play as CJ Toku is not him. This nigga is an asshole. He don't give a fuck about nobody but himself. This is not 
be a fashion video. This is not supposed to be a I hate to see that so cool because I really don't give a fuck about the niggas. But it's the fact that you have children involved and I'm a mother myself is what's really irritating me. And for you to throw out stuff and you know kids would not understand irritates me because you're playing off of a child. You're getting views off of a child. Money off of children that don't know no better. That's looking up to you like you're the dad in their life they don't have. And that shit is foul. Foul. Because you are not something to look up to. The way you disrespect your wife. Mistreat her kids. Disrespect your baby mama. Some shit you just don't do. You are not the best image to be of a man. Period. Come see by me. Marie with two E's, baby. I need a moment. Because I'm getting irritated. And I don't get loud. And I don't like to bash people. Or make it seem like it's a it's a a hate thing. It's not. But when children are involved, I don't give a fuck. The child is my best interest. Because I would want somebody to feel like that about my child. Don't judge me. Look in the mirror and judge yourself. Nigga, take some time to analyze your selfish ass. Your wife is pregnant in the hospital. You talking about she's supposed to do this. She's supposed to be doing that. You sound dumb as fuck in the words of Corey. Be mindful who you look up to. Because everybody's not a role model. Everybody is not the best image. And for you to admit that this is your character. Shit, nigga, I don't even want to know what the fuck your values and morals are. <sighs> Alright, so that's really all I wanted to react to. Because I can't take Martin Lewis, he played too much. And see, that's what Google's enough. All right, Martin Lewis, maybe it ain't you. I just can't fathom the facts that you presented about see, that's so cool. So I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I can't. I can't. All right, you guys. Also, don't forget if you find tea you don't want to spill, at your girl on IG so I can keep it real. I love you, subby. If you haven't became a subby, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and stop what you're doing and hit the subscribe button, turn the notification bell so you never miss a video. You know your girl be spitting real shit over here. I keep it 100 and I'm talking my shit. That's why we doing thoughts and opinions because the thoughts and opinions that's out there, TK, ain't legit. So come join a real one, the best team, the only team. One time for the one time be a subby because you know you're going to win it. I love you and I will see you in my next video. Peace. Hey, me this bitch ahead.